Well, some good news as you're just waking up because Arizona CenturyLink customers could be getting some money back. And you were a former customer. Um, can't so wait. jealous. Can't so wait. jealous. Attorney General Mark Brenovich just announced a huge $11 million settlement with the company. So I know you're all here saying, what? I've got money coming? <laughs> Erinie is here to talk about how this is all over deceptive and unfair advertising and billing practices. Good I knew morning. it. I knew it. <laughs> Yeah, basically they were charging customers more than what they initially advertised. So we're talking about anywhere from $20 to up to $1,000 that you could be getting back if you were a CenturyLink customer between the years of 2013 and 2016. Uh, like you mentioned, the Arizona Attorney General's Office settled an $11 million lawsuit against the company, accusing it of using deceptive and unfair advertising and billing practices. Now, CenturyLink apparently failed to apply up to $1.9 million in discounts to Arizona customers between the years of 2013 and 2016. CenturyLink, as many people know, sells local and long distance telephone services, internet services, as well as TV services. But the settlement will also require the company stop charging the internet cost recovery and early termination fee. So if you are currently a CenturyLink customer, you will actually be getting a refund on your account. But if you were previously one, like Javi, you can actually contact the company to find out more about getting your refund, but they are expected to contact you just how likely that will be. So your best bet is just to give them a call and make sure that you get your money. Reporting live, I'm Erin LeBeau for Arizona's Family.